Hello guys, this is Indian Medico and in this video, we are going to see about conductive hearing loss. This is a concise presentation for medical students. What is a conductive hearing loss? Any disease which interferes with the conduction of sound and reduces the intensity of sound reaching the cochlea causes conductive hearing loss. The lesion may lie in the external ear, tympanic membrane, middle ear or ossicles up to the stapedia vestibular joint. What are the characteristics of conductive hearing loss? Negative Rene test, that is, bone conduction will be better than air conduction, Weber lateralized to the poorer ear, normal absolute bone conduction, low frequencies will be affected more, audiometry shows bone conduction better than air conduction with airborne gap, greater the airborne gap, more is the conductive loss, loss is not more than 60 decibels, speech discrimination is good. Now, if you look at the causes of conductive hearing loss, we can divide them into congenital causes and acquired causes. The congenital causes of conductive hearing loss include meatal atresia, fixation of stapes foot plate, fixation of malleacid, ossicular discontinuity, and congenital cholesteatoma. The acquired causes of conductive hearing loss can again be divided into two types causes in the external ear and causes in the middle ear. If you look at the acquired causes of conductive hearing loss due to a problem in the external ear, it can be due to any obstruction in the ear canal like wax, foreign body, furuncle acute inflammatory swelling, benign or malignant tumor or atresia of canal. Middle ear causes include perforation of tympanic membrane, traumatic or infective, fluid in the middle ear like acute otitis media, serous otitis media or hemotympanum, mass in middle ear like benign or malignant tumor, disruption of ossicles, for example trauma to ossicular chain, chronic separative otitis media, cholesteatoma, fixation of ossicles like otosclerosis, tympanosclerosis, adhesive otitis media, eustachian tube blockage like retracted tympanic membrane, serous otitis media. How do you manage a case of conductive hearing loss? Removal of canal obstructions, removal of fluid, removal of mass from middle ear, stepidectomy, tympanoplasty and hearing aid. Thank you.